Hi guys, in this video we're going to talk about how much protein is too much protein on a ketogenic diet. Okay, Now it's kind of a difficult question because you have so many variables. You have the person's age. For example, if they're 21 or 18, they're going to need more protein than someone like me that's 30 years old. right? And then you have digestion, the ability to digest the protein, the acid in the stomach. If they don't have enough acid, then they're not gonna, that's not, not gonna be a good situation. Or let's say they're under massive stress, they're gonna need a little bit more protein. Or if their metabolism is low, if they have hypothyroidism or some other issue, well, then they can't uh, consume that much protein because it's gonna overload the liver. And then if they're exercising, they need a little bit more, okay? So I have a rule of thumb, a formula that you can use, okay? And this is kinda like the top end, like you don't wanna go more than this because too much protein will convert to insulin and stop your ketosis. Too much insulin, um, too much uh, protein could also mess up your liver and the kidneys because it, it's, just, it's just too much for it to process. So here it is. Do not consume greater than 0.8 grams times your body weight, okay? Let, so I'm six foot two, I weigh 195 pounds, right? If we take that times 0.8, that equals 156 grams per day. We divide it by three, like three meals, that comes out to 52 grams of protein per meal. I don't want to exceed that, okay? So what does that look like? Well, if you ate eight ounces of chicken, that's 62 grams, so it's a little bit more. Eight ounces of steak is 52 grams, so that would equal exactly what I calculated per meal. And then eight ounces of fish is 45 grams. And I do notice that I can actually eat a little bit more fish and not feel as bloated. So this is something that I probably would not want to um, exceed uh, because, for example, my body runs really good on about five ounces of protein. So I'm going to cut this back a little bit. Maybe I'll do six ounces of fish, probably five ounces of chicken or five ounces of steak. I do really good on that. Um, so the best way is to, you know, you can use the formula, but just see how you feel and see how you do. Um, let's see if your is your energy high. Sometimes, if your your diet is too low in protein, you're going to be fatigued. So you want to monitor how you feel to get that sweet spot. But everyone is different. All right, these are just guidelines. So tell me what you think. Put your comments below. Press it. Forget it. Forget it. I'm done. Press the subscribe button, and I will keep you updated on the future events.